Odd one out. Yeah. I like odd one out. They're always good. All right. I think it's got to be this one. And I'll tell you why. Most loyal amongst you. The true OGs, the day ones. will know that a common misconception is that I, your boy, your, your handsome little caramel devil. Uh, people assume that I am a theater kid. No, big difference between just having charisma and being a theater kid. I, just nothing cringier in the world to me and love to you. Be, be yourselves. But I am far too self-resenting, anti-theater. There are no true British theater kids. We, we, we're embedded with too much shame to get anywhere close to the inner public environment singing show tunes despite somebody's child is trying to sleep energy. You know what I mean? At the airport, not moving forward in line because they're laughing at their own jokes too much. That is just, I don't, no thanks, not for me, and it ain't me. She's dressed like a minion? Yeah, this is good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get annoyed. I was rotting in a watery grave, lying in my coffin below, when I heard a voice, yes it's true, that the voice was you. The problem is that it's just my internalized bullying, isn't it? It's, or it's my internalized shame. It's my unwillingness to let people be the way that they are. And I hate that it's in me, but it's also so annoying. <laughs> it's also so annoying is the problem. We brought together seven theater kids. I am a theater kid. I'm a theater kid. I'm a theater kid. I am a theater kid. I'm a theater kid. I'm a theater kid. Yeah, just needed a second with that one. One is a liar. If the group discovers who the liar is, they'll split a cash prize. And the liar is never allowed to act or sing ever again. Dream role. For me, I can't sing, but if I could sing, I would be in Hairspray, um, the, the one who sings Big, Blonde, and Beautiful, Queen Latifah did in the movie. These are all so good. Hairspray was a movie. I was aware, it could, kind of sort of aware of that. I like musicals. I'm not disparaging musicals or the theater in general. What I am not a fan of is any, any hobby or interest used as a, a, a replacement for nuance or a personality. I don't like that. I don't like cults, that's it. I don't like cults. That's what makes me uncomfortable about it. I don't like noise. <laughs> That's the other thing. That one's less, that one's less justifiable. I love to be Aaron Burr. Like, I know, like, I'm like, but like, I could do it. But you guys. If there was a male version of Mecca Beth uh, inside of Midnight Summer Stream, then bam, that's mine. Oh, yeah. Veronica and Heathers. I already guaranteed Evan Hansen. I want to do dramatic. Generic. So. Did you say generic? It's a generic. Dear Evan Hansen, that was so. I can't, by, by the way, I just can't talk about Hamilton at all. There's no good, there's nothing good that will come from me talking about Hamilton. So let's just say that I've watched it and it's great and it's really good. And whatever your opinion is, is also mine. What is the riskiest thing you've ever done right when the house was open? After like- mm, He's using the terminology, he's an insider. He's an inside gamer, he gets it, the house. So uh, mine is usually before every performance where I want the audience to- Yeah, uh, you are seeing it, right? Sorry. I don't have, well, let me just real quick. Uh, initiating vision mode. Hmm, yes. Let me just very quickly. Uh, Daddy Willie 69. Can this go in the video? Mm, no, I can't. I can't do it to you or me. Like a co lead, I'll look straight at him and we start dancing with each other in order to get like the nerves out. For me, I do like the up. one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah. Oh, Everyone does it. Oh, yeah, that's a warm up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, what I like to do is kind of theater kid related stuff. I like to kind of be a theater kid. That's what I do to get ready. He was just very extroverted, and I thought he was trying a little too hard. He didn't talk much. He just didn't give me the vibe of a theater kid. He wasn't in any way obnoxious to be around. <laughs> he was not kind of a complete vacuum for the comfort of those around them. They, they, they were not a, a, operating at a volume that effectively destroyed any kind of small, carefully spoken, delicate, tactful way of communicating. I need, I'm a bully, I'm a bully. Whoa, what's going on here? Was that the last vote? Have we found ourselves, now he's smiling. You know I'm a sucker for a smile. When they cheese in these video, okay, we're on Austin's side, we're on Austin's side. He definitely plays some sort of sport. Devastating. <laughs> to show the other players. Through the line, through the season, they find me. Cause no one knows how far it goes. 
Thank you. I can't summon jokes because he seems very sweet and nice, but also he was a theater kid, wasn't he? We caught him. I was under the impression that this was a 1080p video and yet he was caught in 4K. Round two, the performance round. You will each have 30 seconds to perform. Oh my God, no. <laughs> Oh, I'm so I'm annoyed by this. I'm not excited about it. This is the weirdest thing ever. <laughs> Sorry, I just want to say somebody's been biting my editing style. Somebody's taken little bites out of the old Jordan and Average playbook, aren't they? Average, delete that. We didn't include this edit. It's no longer in the Jubilee video. No non sequiturs other than my videos. Thank you. He has a funny family guy cutaway. Hi, Dad. My enemies have entered the haunted forest. I want you to be there to snatch up that sickening little girl, Dorothy, and her equally nauseating little dog. Okay, you, if you know a monologue, you, you've, it's got to be legit, right? Suspicion gone. So, am I nuts? Because they're also, these people come in, trying to, try to, people come into the studio, and they usually don't really know, like the, the imposter people, I think, usually don't know what they're going to be on. Maybe they, I'm not completely sure. It seems weird for them to prepare to this level. Temi gets ding approval. Uh, diplomatic immunity, ding. Was I too proud with you? Was I too cold and forbidding that you chilled her over me? What's wrong with me? What? This is forcing me to really, really punch back against my own biases. I had to do this like a couple of years ago when I realized that the English meme of our oh, we all hate the French was like a, a teeny weeny bit sincere. <laughs> like there's a little bit of me that was like being a little bit... I would, you, you know, I would, I would, somebody would mention France and be like, oh, the bloody French, don't even get me started. I found another bias. I'm the racist. I'm the theater kid racist, which is the worst kind of racism. She was amazing. She was a good singer. And I was like, well, what if that's what she is? She's just a great singer. You people think you know me, but you don't know squat. Here's a brief memo that you may not have got. Nobody gets me. You say I'm no good. See, I've got a vision. Oh God, he's such a good find if this is the fake. Now they always sometimes, you know, Jubilee will hit you with that, uh, the double swerve, the Tokyo drift, you know, where they find somebody that is technically not a theater kid, but he's like, a, I don't know, like a, 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 an actor or something, or like a professional movie actor or something, you know, or like a voice actor. They get in there somehow, they did the dub for the animated version. You know what? He looks like a bully from a TV show, you know? How like casting agencies, because real bullies don't get into acting. <laughs> so you never actually see them on TV. It's always like, uh, uh, they're always hired, despite the fact that they're like 5'5", five because five, they just found the kind of, they're always the slickest looking bully you can imagine, you know? Hey. Hey, Michael, you've got to give us your lunch money, pal. Like, <laughs> especially in 90s movies where they'll just be dressed in like all denim. They'll effectively be wearing what he's wearing as well as like a, a half tilt fedora. No bully representation. And that's the real racism. That's the other real racism. There's two real racisms. Can I get a stand in real quick? My performance requires uh, a stand. Um, yeah? Cool, cool. <clears throat> My performance is stage combat. <laughs> From up above saying, Johnny, I love you so. That voice told me, Johnny, it's time. Obscure choice. I don't even know what this is. I don't know what, I'm not familiar with zombie prompt. I'm a basic boy, I'm a basic witch, and yet I did not know about that. Meaning that it's a nuanced choice. Either we're operating on five head, ultra brain, multi-dimensional intellect, choosing one that he knows people wouldn't know about. Or he's really just like a theater kid and he, we've transcended, we're in the new realm. Stans, get the hell out of here. Oh, that's what you do. And I knew that the voice, yes, it's true. That the voice was you. I thought it was too over the top to be... It was too over the top. There's no way he's a theater kid. <laughs> I found it too obnoxious. He couldn't be a theater kid. Holding a boom box outside my window. Oh yeah, she's a theater kid. I, I, I saw her in Despicable Me. Preferably one with a really awesome musical number for no reason, but no. John Hughes did not direct my life. She stood like in one place, but then I thought maybe tech theater because that's still technically theater kid. I can never fully tell. 
sometimes. They seem so not it. They seem so odd one out that it's almost like a plan. There's like, it, it has to be a double bluff. Because they were, clearly they just like were nervous and they were not able to fully perform. Oh, I don't know, I don't know. And it's impossible to know. Oh, so they say, all I know is I don't know what to write or the right way to write it. This is big, lady, don't screw it up. This is what I've been waiting for. Well, that plus the screaming of 10 angry editors. A girl, it's a girl. How the hell is that even legal? Look, just go and get her. Salutes in the chat for all the performances. Out of the people who did do singing, I think she did the least convincing. I like all the little doodles they tend to do on the cards. In my fan fiction of these, I like to imagine that drawing all those little doodles just takes like 15 to 20 minutes. <laughs> so there. Wait. I'm sketching a, a, a realistic recreation of Daddy Willie 69. He had this good voice, but like singing in the shower good. But the projection, it didn't feel theatrical. I think Daddy Willy 69 is a good guess. I think Daddy Willy 69 might just be an extroverted person. Bad. I'm gonna get snacks. Oh, no, he's a theater kid. The alarm has. What's that in the sky? Oh, it's the Truth Gremlin. He's floating down. Hello, Truth Gremlin. Was my take wrong? It was extremely unbased, and he's obviously a theater kid. Damn it, shit, asshole. Starting now, for every time all of you vote out someone that is not the mole, the prize money will be reduced by half. Please raise your hand if you want to continue playing the game. That was quite a theatrical reveal. That, see, that was a, a villain in a high school production. I'll keep playing your games. Uh, I'm starting to realize what people think of a theater kid. How many minutes are there in a year? 525,600 Hell yeah, that's from the fucking show. I was in like theater tech. I mostly did props and stuff. Yeah, I, I've done theater for like eight years, but then like two, maybe three years ago, I transferred to like- But then I transferred to being a kid. So now I'm a theater kid. Can everyone do their best slate? Hi, my name is Lauren Willard. I'm 18 years old, 5'4", and I'm from Sacramento. And I'm a theater kid. Oh, shit, sorry. Hi, my name is Callie Sutton. I'm 16 years old. I currently live in- <laughs> She about to kick my ass. What the hell was that? Old. I currently live in- <laughs> <laughs> Hello, uh, my, the name's Callie and- I'm here to fuck up. <laughs> I'm the strong theater kid. I'm here to defend all of my beta cuck friends. Can we all go um, downstage left? Would not be here because it's That's from- That's house left. So yeah. this is the left for the house. And then stage left is our left. It was her suggestion. Oh no. That's such a, if it's her, that's such a cell phone. Oh my God. That's rough, man. Especially if she is a theater kid. That's so much worse. Now she just has to be a kid. Oh no. That's awkward. Awkward. Now everyone go upstage right. <laughs> she just walks off. Over here? Uh, yeah, yeah, that's what okay. This is Because this is the stage. So stage is ours, and then house is theirs. You learn that from your first show. I, I learned that and had to memorize that on my first show I ever did. That's rough. Okay, what's a word you can't say in the theater? Oh, uh, the N word. Uh, <laughs> oh, it's funny you ask. I actually, let me just check my phone. I have a list of cool slurs. What's your least favorite thing about being in theater? A lot of people tend to be cocky. Oh, the drama oh. in drama. Yeah. Yeah. Probably all the theatering. It should have put me on this one, and I'm just standing. Standing in the light, <laughs> standing in the light up. Every every time they start singing or being extroverted, I'm just like, oh, no. <sighs> looking around desperately for lockers to put them in. If you do stage work and directing, I think you would know like which is how yeah, to have how to definitely right. They should do six nerds and one secret bully. Six bullies, and then when they find the nerd, they just beat the shit out of them. <laughs> Please raise your hand if you want to continue playing the game. <gasps> if the lights turn green, that means you have voted out the mole and you win. If the lights turn red... Make the call. Make the call. Oh, no. Come on. Mm -mm -mm. Make the call. Make the call. All right. Okay. I genuinely don't know. Oh, God. Mm, no. It, it could be Austin because he was just, you know, he's so charming and he can trick you and he he looks like a, a one of the bullies from Stand By Me, but I don't know, man. The mole is still in the box and you I think, lose. I think, macro, uh, I think Justin Timberlake hair is, I think it's green. 
What? God damn it! I should have just not said anything. I should have just not said anything. Was she attacked, by the way? What happened here? Was there a... I did, how did I miss that? Was there a wolf attack in the studio? You... <laughs> no, what? It could never be. There is no way. And I was like, okay, it's Austin. I was like, it's Austin. Will the fake theater kid please step forward and reveal yourself in... It's her! We found it! She's... <gasps> Look at her hiding in the corner like we won't find you, you sneaky little devil. Three, two, one. Oh, fuck's sake. Just they quadruple bluffed us. Despicable them, actually. Despicable them. All seem very extroverted, and I kind of like their, their energy, but I don't think I could be an actor, and I don't think I could be around that 24-7. Based. Oh, let's go. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> Oh wow, it's not really money though. I would have liked to have the money is the thing instead though. Oh, bag, cool. I mean, I'd love to be on Broadway, you know. I, I'd also love to do touring casts. I'd, I'd just love to be part of the community. I gotta excise this demon. This dark part of me that is holding people like Austin back from pursuing their dreams. Austin, I am so sorry, my friend. Oh my goodness, I don't know why I'm like this. Could it be that I'm just a fundamentally uh, cynical person and that people expressing their passions in a very sincere way goes against my inescapable urge to destroy happiness in any form that I find it? Ah, uh, hmm. Hmm. Well, I'll stop crying if you think about that too much. Thanks for watching the video. I'm so sorry for the person that I am. I'll catch you next time. Um, don't hit the bell as well. Don't subscribe. Unsubscribe. Please don't unsubscribe. Just, um... DM me and say, what have you done? What have you done? Good night, love you. Kiss. My heart is focused on Bob Cuts and Adderall Long Cuts and retakes, redub my remakes Mistakes I won't make like mistakes A full bus punch in, boy, then we replay